what's up? You're watching Dave the Hearing Aid Guy. My name is Dave and I'm a hearing professional with plus 20 years of experience in fitting hearing aids. And today I'll have a look at the ReSound One hearing aids. But before I do that, please subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any of my new videos. The One is ReSound's latest hearing aids family. They offer RIC and PTE versions, both rechargeable or battery powered. In my hand, I'm holding the rechargeable version. And first thing to notice is that there are no charging contacts. This is because ReSound uses inductive charging, so you won't find charging contacts neither on the hearing aids nor in the chargers. There are pros and cons to inductive charging. Pro, when there are no charging contacts, the hearing aids are less prone to letting humidity and dust in. Contra, it takes longer, but however, as long as most people usually charge the hearing aids overnight, that's only a minor disadvantage. Now let's go on with the hearing aid and what we can see. Here is a programmable push button to adjust volume and switch through the hearing programs. Two microphone inlets, an LED light, a receiver cable, and here is the receiver. And this is a special receiver, it's called Marie, because it consists of a receiver here and an additional microphone that sits in the ear canal. This leads to a better perception of directionality and depth. In fact, the additional microphone picks up the sounds that are reflected from the outer ear into the ear canal, which is referred to as pinna effect. So this is where the receiver cable goes into the hearing aid. Now let's see what technology is working inside the ReSound One. There are four technology levels available, nine, seven, five, and four. The level nine premium device comes with five hearing programs, seven, five, and four come with four hearing programs. And while all four technology levels are only slightly different from each other, levels nine and seven had a huge advantage over five and four when it comes to directionality and to understanding speech and noise. ReSound's newest features are called All Access Directionality and Ultra Focus. All Access Directionality is a special strategy to optimize the microphone directionality so that there are benefits from better understanding when moving through daily listening situations. Ultra Focus combines the directionality of both hearing aids to improve speech understanding in very noisy situations. Of course, these hearing aids come with Bluetooth, a smartphone app to adjust the volume in the hearing programs, and remote fitting support. Direct sound streaming, for example phone calls, is supported for iPhones and many new Android phones. There are three chargers available. The premium charger, which has a built-in power bank, the standard charger without power bank, and the desktop charger. Premium charger and the standard charger have LED lights that give you information about the charging status. The desktop charger is the very basic version. The Smart 3D app gives you full control over your hearing aids. It lets you control the volume, the hearing programs, the charging status and the connection status. Also, it helps you find your hearing aids if you can't find them and enables remote services from your hearing professional. My conclusion is that ReSound has made a pretty good job with the ReSound One. They were able to improve the ReSound Quattro the ReSound One has a classy hearing aid design, they are rechargeable and battery powered versions and it's suitable for all kinds of hearing loss. The Marie receiver helps to get a more natural sound and is available for technology levels 9 and 7. Before you decide on these hearing aids, I recommend checking if your phone is supported by ReSound so you can enjoy hands free calling and music streaming. Your hearing professional can help you with that and there's also a list of compatible mobile devices online. So this was another episode of Dave the Hearing Aid Guy. Please leave your questions in the comment sections below and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. See you next time. Bye.